I want to draw your attention to these two orders here. Uh, so I've got one from Morrison's and one from Burger King. These are how I earn extra money on my days off. Um, we're basically not working whatsoever. So on my day off this week, I needed to build two new beds for my toddlers uh, because they're escaping from their cots and put up some new curtains because the curtains they had um, were too long. So I need new curtain poles, blah, blah, blah. Basically, we got the curtain poles, got everything ready, built the cots, and then I realised I didn't have the brackets to hold the curtain poles up with. So I knew, knew that at some point that day, I needed to go out to Ikea. I knew exactly where they were. Uh, so I knew I'd be in there really quick. So I knew I had to go to Ikea. There's a Morrison's down the road from me that does Deliveroo. Quite often you can pick up jobs that go out to a place called um, Newcourt, which is right next to Ikea. Down the road from Ikea is the Burger King. So I thought, no, yeah, what's the odds? Um, I go out whenever I get an order, turned on Deliveroo and waited for a Morrison's delivery to come through. So I waited for a few hours and this one come through, £8.96. And it literally took me next door to Ikea. There's some houses literally the other side of the car park. So um, obviously I picked up that one. It was rush hour, so it was not the best. But I mean, I needed to go that way anyway and I got paid £8.96. So nearly £9 to drive somewhere. I was going to drive anyway with the petrol. I was going to use anyway with only a sort of like 20 meter detour uh the morrison's is literally at the bottom of my street i would have had to drive drove i would have had to drive past it to go anyway <coughs> excuse me knowing that i only needed to be in ikea for literally five minutes i left delivery on whilst i was in ikea this one popped up burger king now this one burger king is like I say, it's at the service station, which is literally just down the road from IKEA, less than a mile. Um, and it was coming back to about half a mile from my house. And this one was paying, sorry, let me look Put it on this phone here £6.81. Um, so let's do some quick maths because basically I got paid to drive to IKEA and paid to drive back from IKEA on my day off. So it's all extra earnings for trips that I was doing anyway. So this is a way to generate extra income on your day, days off. Um, let's see if I can quickly do it in my head. 8.96 plus six, I'm going to do it on the calculator. £15.77 extra that I earned in my income stream Uh on my day off with no real extra effort it might have literally been five minutes work if that and that's how i've worked out that you can earn on your days off so i always only turn one app on because you don't want all the apps pinging off at you all day for me it's generally i turn on delivery because it's like there's like i said there's a morrison's at the bottom of my street and i will get offers from there i do it nearly every single day uh, that I have a day off. If I know that I need to go somewhere, but it doesn't matter when I need, when I go there, I'll just turn the apps on and wait and see. Like for example, if I need to go to the tip, uh, got the car loaded up, I just hang around for like half an hour, have a drink, you know, do the other stuff that I was going to do, and wait for an order to come through that will take me towards the tip or um, towards Big Tesco or anything, you know. So that's a way that I find it's great. It's a way to earn money. On your days off, you get paid for your trip out there, paid for your trip back, and it's all petrol and time that you would have spent anyway. Hope this has been um, informative and it's helped you in some kind of way, and I'll catch you on the next video. Cheers.